Hi, I'm Shane, owner of Integrity Realty Group with Remax Professionals, and this is your July market update. Today we're at the Rogue Tomato, a recently opened restaurant in Arrowhead Ranch Plaza, just opened February 22nd of 2016. It's a great community restaurant, now open for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. They offer weekly specials, Taco Tuesday, Wine Down Wednesday, Thirsty Thursday, with live music weekly. The Rogue Tomato offers incredible food. The specialties that include blue corn crab cakes, pecan smoked chicken, and soon to be famous carrot cake. Guys, I'm a carrot cake connoisseur, and their carrot cake is excellent. Well, I'm Chef Devin. And I'm Chef Shane. Rogue Tomato was a concept. We, uh, we invented it together just as a kind of escape from the corporate world. We clearly wanted to have our our way, our independent restaurant. We want to be able to offer the dishes, um, the flavors and stuff that, that we enjoy without being encumbered with, uh, you know, restrictions from the man upstairs. So it was just kind of a playful concept that Chef Devin and Chef Shane are breaking free. Yeah, we're still trying to feel out the neighborhood to see actually what, what they like. And so far, you know, the comfort food, lemon chicken pasta, uh, we put out kind of a famous meatloaf, uh, seem to be uh, dominating sales. We just watch what the people want and slowly tweak the menu. Crab cakes, Chef Devin, uh, we did crab cakes up north together where we used to work at. And uh, they seem to be pretty popular. There's an appetite for one gen dinner. On that, we do have our uh, build your own burger. We originally came up with the concept to have a build your own burger, and then uh, oddly enough, a week later, Arizona Republic voted us best burger in the West Valleys. So uh, we're kind of proud of that. Um, we're going to venture later on to do some more stuff on weekends. But, uh, so new, we really haven't even begun to do actual dinner specials yet because we're still tweaking the menu, training the kitchen, so we'll unleash a lot of interesting specials as time goes on, as well as special events, you know, that'll feature wine tasting and, and private events and things along those lines as well. So we, we, we're just a baby, you know, we've got a long ways to expand on all of that. Well, I think its roots are definitely in comfort food, wouldn't you say? But it's done right. It's very refined. We don't just throw ingredients together in a bowl. We slow roast those ingredients. We take every ingredient to the point where it's the best it can be, and then say we make our meatloaf. So it just explodes with flavor. So it's just very refined comfort food. You'll you'll recognize everything on the menu. There's nothing on there you can't pronounce. It was a Chinese restaurant before that. It was half of a salon, half of a restaurant. They merged it. We kind of uh, took it over. We pretty much did everything from uh, all the wood you see, the brick on the walls, the ceiling tiles on the uh, three months of both of our, a yeah. lot of hard work. It was basically a hodgepodge of uh, leftover collection of furniture and mismatched colors when we walked in here. And I'm, I'm pretty proud of, between myself, Shane, and a little help from my wife Jenna. Um, you know, we picked out all the colors, everything from the vinyl to the floor. Um, you know, behind you, of course, I, I built a lot of cabinetry, being as I'm an old carpenter. And it, we pat ourselves on the back sometimes. It came out kind of even here. We get a lot of compliments on it. So. Um, oh, well, music is something we've just recently started trying, and it started just with some acoustic guitars. Um, and I think it was New Year's Eve that made us look a little deeper. We wanted to see who was out there. So now we also have a, a, a jazz duet that uh, played with us a few times. And for the first time tomorrow night, we're actually going to have a bluegrass band in here. So we're not trying to turn it into a concert venue by any means. We're just trying to keep it interesting um, so, so people feel like they're going to a trendy place and uh, they're having a good time, not just a mere dinner out. So. Come down and see Chef Devin and Shane. Say hi. Experience all that the Rogue Tomato has to offer. Enjoy the live music, the weekly specials, and come support your, your local community restaurants. Let's talk some market data now. In the month of June, there were 9,000 homes sold. This is the busiest month in over five years. Pretty consistent with where we were in May. Things are tracking up. Average sales price stayed about the same, right around 283,000. Average time on market did drop a little bit. We're down to 55 days. It's an incredible time to sell and buy. You don't really experience a market like this very often where it's not only a seller's market, but it's also a buyer's market. What I mean by that is homes are selling very quick. There's a lot of buyers in the market. Inventory is extremely low. That creates a very good condition to sell a home. On the other side of that, interest rates are extremely low. We're at nearly historic lows. In fact, on a 15 year fixed rate mortgage, it's the lowest it's been in recorded history. Right now, we just saw last week a client get a 15-year mortgage 
at 2.75%. Their payment actually went down $7 from where they were with their 30 year fix. There's a lot of lenders right now that are doing no cost refis because rates are so low. That now creates an incredible time to buy as well. So it's a very unique market. We don't see this very often. Um, every five to seven years, I would say, it's, it's a great time to buy and sell. So there's a lot of people right now that if you're looking to sell to either upgrade, maybe even downsize, but if selling and buying is in your near future, this is probably the time to do it. There's also a lot of people that are taking advantage of the recent equity in their home. Combined with the low interest rates, we're seeing a lot of second homes being purchased, cabins, vacation homes, whatever the case may be. I hope you guys enjoyed this market update. If you have any questions, as always, my contact info is here. We'd love to talk to you. We'll talk to you guys soon.